Hi, I'm Sasha Ronko. Hey, I'm Julia. Max Sasha Eva. Val. Sebastian Trusten. Maya. Michael Levy. Louis. Monty Pierce Jones. Do your homework. Because it's practice for your clock. Don't stress because it will get harder and like there's no point in stressing because you're still like in year nine, like it's not that bad and it's just gonna get like harder. So my advice is pretty much the same. And my advice to the grade below is probably to have good friends because they're really good for support. My advice to year nines is that the pasta line is better than the other two lines. Use your lockers because you guys will give yourself back problems if you don't use your lockers. So just remember to use them. I'm yeah, the only advice that we can give you is don't do your homework last minute. Take good notes in class. Like stressful, and you'll go to sleep late, and then you won't have a productive day at school the next day. And also, um, be nice with your teachers because they'll remember you in the years after. <laughs> Bye, sis. Enjoy. enjoy it. Enjoy your year. It's gonna be one of the calmest years you're gonna be able to enjoy. You're gonna be able to hang out with your friends, have fun classes, be able to discover what subject actually interests you, and it's the last year when there's gonna be subjects that are gonna be kind of forced on you, so even though that's kind of bad, just look up to the future and chill. A good advice for year 10 is to like keep your notes, and even if you do like bad in a test, don't throw your test away. Because like at the end of the year, you'll need it a lot. You need to respect your teacher in year 12 and then in year 11. And then when you go in year 12, like people, the teacher will really appreciate your, the fact that you you are actually showing an interest. Because in year 12, they're going to be so harsh on you if you haven't respected them in the year before. So yeah, that's just respect your teacher in year 11. Don't forget to be funny, savage, and uh, positive. Yeah, just really make the most of every day. Just carpe diem. By 12th grade, it's over. <laughs> Don't take uh, 9th, 10th, and 11th grade uh, that seriously. Uh, as long as you get the courses you want for your IB, it's fine. And then 12th grade, do a little bit more work than I and most of the 12th graders did. For people starting the IB, you should really be on top of your deadlines because it will pile up. But honestly, your 12th is not as bad as they say. When you get them, like, don't leave it hanging until the very last second. My advice to you guys is don't stress it, honestly. Like, just do what you have to do, but don't, like, overdo it, or else you'll just get too stressed. And my advice for the year 12 is do all your work in year 12. Like me, I didn't do in year, in year 12. I didn't do my EE, I didn't do my IAs, I still have to do my physics IA. I, still didn't, I didn't do any meetings with the college counselors to do those. And I, I didn't do a lot of stuff in year 12 and I thought it's okay, I'll do it in year 13. Don't, don't do that.